Welcome back. We are here looking at the cryptocurrency market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for the cryptocurrency market for Tuesday, November 24th, 2020. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos, and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon, where you can get access to our full technical analysis, our signal service, and also our live trades. And you can find the link down below. So at this point, Bitcoin has run into resistance at 18,906. That is where we have run into resistance. So the all-time highs is around 20,200. Uh, we broke down significantly here, all the way down to 70,500, and then rallied again. And at the, today, we are again showing signs of weakness. So if you look at technical negative for Bitcoin, it is highly likely that we are going to break down from here. If you look at a Fibonacci retracement, go all the way down here and then look at this. We could expect Bitcoin to go all the way down to 13,000. However, we will run into the uh, uh, 50 moving average first. So uh, more realistic will be that we'll look at this area here. And that means that our first Fibonacci retracement is at 15,450. 44 and our next is here at 14,363 and that is more likely the uh, more likely what is going to happen we'll fall towards this area here and then rally again if we break through that 50 moving average then that opens the door to these very lows at 12,000 but at this point that is not very likely but a pullback towards the uh, the fib is is very likely for bitcoin at this point um uh, if it doesn't happen now, it will happen when we hit the all-time highs. So if we look at Ethereum, we can see that this market has absolutely exploded to the upside. So we are at 603 at this point, and we haven't been this high since all the way back in 2018. So we can find the, this resistance area here at 600. That is the resistant area here. And at this point, we are significantly overbought. So we are at 83. And these technical indicators are showing signs of exhaustion. Both the stochastic, the CCI are showing signs of exhaustion. So we will most likely have a pullback towards the 50. Probably the target here will be uh, 500 or these previous highs of 480. That will also coincide with this, uh, these highs here. So whether or not this goes higher, probably, um, uh, but uh, we are very overstretched and a pullback towards the 500 area would make a lot of sense. So there's no way it's interesting of uh, basically buying this. This is a probable sell if you get a very negative candlestick here, and then that is possible to sell it towards the 500 or this area 480. But probably the best idea is to just wait for a fall and then buy that dip. So hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by subscribing. Hit the like button, bell button in order to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. Good luck and thank you very much.